Uh, next up is John Ziegler, and then Deborah Baber will be in after. After waiting for two hours and now getting two minutes, I'll get right to the point. Uh, this board is pretending that for the last three months, your emperor, Dr. Levin, has not been against a mask declaration. Now, all of a sudden, we're pretending that masks are everything, even forcing speakers to use masks. I would like the board to take a position. Was Dr. Levin wrong for those three months? And if he was this wrong, why has he not been removed? Why has he not been fired for being so catastrophically wrong? Or do you not really believe he was wrong? You're just wearing these masks because it is a signal of your great virtue. Damn! Damn. Because for the last three months, we have not worn them. And Ventura County has done outstandingly well and continues to do outstandingly well because we are not Los Angeles. We are not New York City. We never were going to be any of those things. Ironically, this is one of the few things Dr. Levin was actually right about. He has been wrong about everything. He is the one who told us we would have four to 600 hospitalizations a day. He, he, he revised that to two to 400 a day. We still haven't reached that in one day. We're barely over 200 for the entire ordeal that you guys have put us through. We now are panicked over 51 total hospitalizations in a county with eight hospitals. Can you people do math? Can you please do basic math and understand where we are on this? This is not a crisis. You, however, have created one. You, in an effort to try to prevent all death, when we've had 43 deaths, have now ended all relevant life. And you should all be ashamed of yourselves. And this will never be forgotten, ever be forgotten. You will all be held accountable eventually, in this life or the next. You all better hope there is no hell, because when you die, that's where you're going. And guess what? You're not going to be dying of COVID either. Thank you.